break. Very little time. I'm almost at work. I just want to make a very quick video. I watched maybe the first, listened to the first half hour of your own Ruvain's comments. Uh, it's the 35th episode of the comments on, on the Sefer with the Mashiach. And he's uh, the Kuntris and he, and he, and he takes time to, uh, to insult uh, Ramesha Weinberger. And that's where this one young man uh, who, who was not from the Klal Yisrael was uh, getting his, his uh, that we, we mentioned last week where he was getting his um, his cues from and again I think the answer has to be that's one part of it and the other part of it is the translations of words because I, I guess you know the, the claim that he's making is that the, there's apicorsis I guess because he's koifer on the on the one of the Yud Gimelikrim, which is Harva Einish, that, 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 that Rabbi Weinberger denies uh, that there's such a thing as, as I, I'm going to have to use the Hebrew word, Harva Einish, because he doesn't like to use the word re reward and punishment. It's kind of a babyish idea, reward and punishment. Um, I, I, I'm, I'm driving right now into prison. And, and where do I work for the DOC, the Department of Corrections? It's not the DOP, it's not the Department of Punishments. Um, and, that's, and that's why my attitude here in the prison is that this is not a house of punishment, it's a house of correction. And it's the same thing. Uh, Rabbi Weinberger made it very clear that Gehinnom is a painful place. But is that, uh, uh, is, is, but is there a lack of love in those corrections, you know, the way that I'm here involved in corrections, and I think, and, and, and the big problem with this is that Yaron Ravain's Israeli, he should know, is, is the, is the Ivrit language really, I guess it's that tainted, like Satmarov said, that it's, it's mamish like the Zionist language they made up, it's mamish like, uh, like, like, like a Vodizara. They, they, they don't hop. What does it mean that there's a difference between oinish and punishment? It's a different world. And I think that's really what it comes down to. We could talk about Chil Shabbos and all these other things they talked about. Certainly, because the truth is, there are shirim from Rabbi Weinberger where he discusses is that he said, yeah, there is a certain point where you have to talk about the oinish and you have to talk, you have to bring out the 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 menorahs or the others uh, or the rishis chokhmah and talk about Gehenna and they're, they're, you have to know who you're dealing with and 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 uh, he was reading it that this that this young lady needed to hear the the other side there's two sides I, could, I mean I know, I'm 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 quoting Shiram that Rabbi Weinberger gave I don't have time to talk more thank you for watching God bless please like share and subscribe comment we'll see you later.